Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time here, then just welcome. Please hit the subscribe button and the bell so you're notified each time I upload a new video. So let's go ahead and get right into today's Let's Play. The last time we were playing, Simone found out that she was pregnant. She does not know who she's pregnant by, but she's hoping that it is by Devin. And she did take a pregnancy test and it came out positive, but she wants to make sure that it is positive. So she's going to go to the doctor so that she can get a checkup. So she's still feeling she's still feeling like she could be though y'all but look at that belly we know that she got to be pregnant but yeah simone wants to make sure that she is because she cannot believe that she could be pregnant let's check on oh oh no kaya what's going on kaya simmering rage y'all it's back <laughs> Kaya still feels a quiet fury beneath the surface from grudges not yet forgotten. So is she still, is that still Simone? Girl. Oh my gosh. Did Simone come up in here and touch her toys again or touch something that belongs to her? Y'all don't even know. Kaya going through it though. She is not happy. Okay, so now I guess someone would like to come over to hang out. Is that okay? Y'all, I don't know what Simone would say. Would she say it's okay to come or maybe she'll just let her come. She don't know if she should have said that, but she's just like, whatever. Although she's feeling like she shouldn't have. And Kaya is asking Devin for a bath. But Devin's got a piece so freaking bad. And on top of all of that, he didn't forgot that he has class. So, y'all, Devin is running late and he got to use the restroom. Look how fast he's running out. He's so freaking late to class. But he's about to leave and he's going to leave the kids here with Sanai. Y'all, it says that they're going to daycare, but... It don't even make sense. There's someone in the house. He's leaving them. We're going to just say he's leaving them with Sanai. Okay, y'all. Simone is back from the doctor. I guess she does know that she is actually pregnant. Baby is progressing well. Simone must be doing something right. So, y'all. Simone is confident. Why is she so confident? I don't know. I think she... I think in her mind, she knows that Devin is the dad. She has no question whatsoever because the last time they were together, they had a good old time. They did husband and wife things. And all she knows is that she has to be pregnant by her husband. Tender love and care. What is this cozy fire? Inconvenient, what? inconvenient from out of relationship pregnancy simone didn't woohoo with her official partner recently um yes she did or not in any way that could cause pregnancy um yes she did <laughs> so there is no way this baby is theirs and of course they will know as soon as they notice her pregnant belly if simone's cheating was still a secret soon it won't be anymore <sighs> what i hate it here but what if Simone has worries piling up and can't maintain her confidence in the face of it. So y'all, Simone is like she's she's battling. It's like she knows the baby gotta be Devin's. It's got it gotta be Devin's. She was safe. She was protecting herself when she was with Raymond. She knows she, like what? No, it's Devin's baby. I was protecting myself. There's no way that this baby is Raymond's. But then she's like, but what if it is? Simone, oh, Simone. Oh, what is going on with Sanai? I don't know, but she ain't feeling too great. Like she's embarrassed or something. But Simone is excited to see her sister, of course. 
So she gives her a nice big hug. So nice, so cute. Look at her, girl. She's like, how have you been? It's been a while since you've been over here. You've been doing good. She's like, yeah, I've been doing good. Today has just been, you know, one of those days though. She's like, girl, but you got it. You're doing okay. You'll be fine. Simone has learned that tonight is self-assured. Devin is off to class again. Oh, so now I must have a headache. <laughs> Simone got up. She got up and came over here and sat down to eat. What is this? Blueberry pancakes? Berry Belgian waffles. Girl, okay. Simone is. She does not know whether she should tell Sanai that she's pregnant or not because. Well, we all know why. So. <laughs> We all know why because. <laughs> so now I was in here taking care of the baby and Simone's like, um, are you planning on having any kids anytime soon? Because girl, I am leaving you in the dust. And she's like, yeah, I want, I want kids. I want, I love kids. I want a big family. And she's like, well, girl, hurry up. I would like for at least one of our babies to grow up together or all of our babies to grow up together. Knowing Simone, y'all. I just cannot with Simone. Because she knowing dang well that she's probably pregnant by her sister's husband. Devin is back home from class. He is embarrassed. I don't know why, but he should have been more embarrassed when he was going to class in his pajamas and no shoes on. Simone is in the bathroom giving herself a pep talk because she knows she got to tell Devin that she's pregnant. She's trying to work herself up because she needs this confidence. She needs this boost because she knows that she's done something wrong so she has come out of the bathroom and look how she's looking over at him and Simone's gonna go ahead look how she's looking at him <laughs> she's gonna go ahead and tell him that she's pregnant <laughs> and I'm guessing he was excited about it y'all look at like y'all if Oh my gosh, you just cannot make some things up. Look at them, they're both so excited about the baby. Y'all, they are cute. Psyched up. Yep, she had to do that. All is well from announcing pregnancy. Simone's partner took the news of the pregnancy rather well. They're open to having children and are glad to share this experience with Simone. What a relief. Okay, eating for two good company good vibes postpartum depression will be gone in 21 hours okay good what is this what is this feeling unsure something went wrong and simone is losing her confidence okay f is for failure from talking about the future i'm probably one of the worst procrastinators that you could ever meet it's like I know I have goals that I want to achieve, but maybe I set my standards too high. It shouldn't take this long for me to be able to say I accomplished something. Guess my heart just isn't into it. What is that from? Is that from her book? Because it is taking a long time for her to write that book. Pinch of salt and laughter. They say too many cooks will spoil the broth, but remembering all those cooking jokes fills Simone with laughter. Okay, so she has lady oh my gosh i cannot i i'm guessing that simone was able to you know tell devin that he really is the father of her baby because she believes y'all simone i'm not kidding y'all she really believes that devin is the father of her child she she knows that she was way too safe to be pregnant by raymond like what no it didn't happen that's Devin's baby and she's sticking to it. Like Simone out here feeling like she ain't doing nothing wrong. And hey, hey, I'm just, I'm just the messenger y'all. <laughs> she really feels like she's doing nothing wrong. And my girl is walking around here pregnant by Devin right now. But we'll see when the baby comes. No bad surprise. Devin's partner says Devin is the father of the child. Whether wanting children or not, in an exclusive relationship is still comforting to know that at least your partner's child is also yours no surprises here okay 
So she said it is his. Like Simone's out here like um addition to the family from pregnancy announcement. Devin and his partner are going to have a child. Lots of responsibilities involved, but they'll figure it out. Like Devin. Oh, I just be wanting to Simone, man. Devin is that dude. Like, look at him. He's He's so freaking happy. Like, you can't tell Devin nothing right now. He knows he got another baby on the way. He's a family man already. He's so excited about it. But is the baby his? Simone said it is, so I guess it is. So Simone's going to go ahead and clean this sink. Like, like y'all, she's feeling good about herself, even though she knows she's been being kind of dirty. But she feels as though she's good. Like, girl. Hey, Simone, it's me, Raymond. Do you want to go out on a date at the Rattlesnake Juice? Ooh, I think she might go because Devin is home so he can take care of the babies. She also needs to tell Raymond that she is pregnant because if he finds out through the grapevine, he ain't going to be too happy about that, especially if the baby is not his. Or even if it is his, he ain't going to be happy to find out from somebody else and not Simone. So she got to cover everything. She got to let everybody know, both of them know that they, that she is pregnant. She got to let him know in hopes that he'll back up a little bit because Devin is, yeah, y'all, I just don't even know. Sometimes I just don't even know what to say, but she's going to go. They have made it to the bar. Ooh, Simone. And she's going to go ahead and ask this dude to mix her a drink. What kind of drink could she... Ooh, let's do a root beer float. I think that's the only thing that she can have. Does not look like there's anything else here. Let's just do a root beer float. Let's be safe. That thing look good, too. Go and drink it some more before somebody else come get it. Ooh, why are they looking so awkward? So mom's like, boy, you look, you look nice. Look at Simone. She's like, you look nice today. Let's go. They're going to go to the back. And because Simone needs to talk to Raymond. You make my day so much better. Thanks for making me smile. And Simone is telling him, she told him that she is pregnant, and now she's telling him, but I'm sorry, it, it can't be yours. Raymond is, oh my gosh, she's so hurt. Simone! Y'all, let me see what it says. That's the old one. This one is the deep connection. Okay. Smooth liar from lying about parenthood. It's not pretty to lie, but Simone has her reasons. Um, she got a lot of reasons. <laughs> oh my gosh, Simone. News badly received from disclosing parenthood. Simone's partner reacted poorly to being told they are not the other parent for Simone's latest child. <sighs> Y'all, Raymond wanted that baby. Oh my gosh. But she's like, I'm sorry because we were safe. There's no way that the baby could be yours because we were protected. And he's like, but that don't mean that it can't be mine. He's like, it, that doesn't mean that it can't be his. He's like, um, but the many times that we have that as a possibility that this baby could be my baby. So he wants her to, you know, let him know whether he really is the father or not. He wants her to take a DNA test to make sure we should go exploring together. Y'all, he's in love with Simone. Simone is, she's in love with two men. It's a hot mess. Look at her. And they're just talking. And Simone, 
she's apologizing to him because she did not realize that it would hurt him so bad knowing that she is pregnant and that she really believes that he's not the father. Like, y'all, Simone ain't playing. She is like, there's no way. There's no way. This cannot be my life that I will be pregnant by another man that's not my husband. She knows she's been doing get her pregnant things with another man. He's hurt. Raymond feels wronged by Simone and being around Simone will remind Raymond of that pain. And Simone's bladder is about to explode so she is going to the restroom. And she's just washing her hands. And now she's going to go ahead and freshen up before she goes back out. Y'all, Simone is a mess. Look at her. <laughs> oh, my. oh, my gosh. And Raymond come walking right on in. Okay. That's weird, but okay. Y'all, Simone need to get her life. No, she not. No, she not. Look at Raymond. Why would you be in the same restroom? They don't have women and men separate. Oof. Oh, Simone. And she turns right around and places one on Raymond. This date just keeps getting better. What? This was a good date to you, Raymond? She told you that she was not pregnant by you. Well, that was a nice time. I'll call you maybe. You better. Simone, like, you better call. Look at her. She's like, oh, you gonna call? <gasps> Y'all, if they can't not be, they can't be any cuter. Like, what? They gonna slow dance in the freaking bathroom to what music? Are they listening to music? There's probably some music going on in the bar, but. <laughs> oh my gosh. They are slow dancing in the bathroom. This is crazy. Okay. Yo, I feel like Simone has Raymond exactly where she wants him. Like he's completely in love with her. She has had two and a possible three babies on him that are not his. Well, at least two of them ain't, but this third one just might be. And he is just like, he wants Simone so freaking bad. But he he's married to her freaking sister, her twin sister, no less. Like, y'all, this is, this is some messy, messy, messiness. What does it say? Oh, 13 hours. It's going to be gone feeling close they are having a good little date although it was just like <laughs> date success there's nothing like a successful date to raise a sim's expectation of what a romance okay feeling flirty glamorous presence feeling attractive ap after primping in the mirror I'm dating. It was nice to go on a date, even if it wasn't perfect. And it was not perfect. Oh my gosh. Simone. I feel like she, um, she kind of almost ruined it. Y'all, Simone has been, I don't know what to say about Simone. Like, <laughs> I never really know what to say about Simone. She is... A different kind of chick I don't even know Simone's gonna go ahead and lay another one on Raymond she's gonna embrace him tell him good night and then she's gonna go home look at them they just can't keep their hands off of each other oh my gosh y'all romantic dance rolling with feelings of passion and happiness after the romantic dance with the loved one Oh my gosh, look at her with that dopey in love walk. Oh my gosh, y'all. <laughs> Simone has made it home. She's in here brushing her teeth and she's going to bed. Look at Simone. She's so tired. Girl, you have a screaming baby. Hurry up and feed your baby. She wants to cloud gaze with Devin. 
I think Simone is in denial, y'all. She didn't came straight. It's like straight from postpartum depression to denial. Like she feels as though there's no way this baby can be Raymond's. Yeah, she thought that the last time, and it actually was right. She, her baby was not Raymond's, but this time, y'all, she tripping. Like she's totally tripping. Look at her. Simone always has super bad morning sickness, all day sickness. And now she's about to go to sleep. Oh no. Simone and woke up. Oh, she's throwing up, y'all. Oof. She woke up out of her sleep and she had to throw up. She was feeling nauseous. Morning sickness. Simone woke up feeling violently ill as if something was pushing her insides all around. Gross taste from throwing up. Simone has this nasty taste in her mouth. She could need a mint or a toothbrush. So she needs to brush her teeth. Oh my gosh. And she has a sore throat. She's going to go ahead and brush her teeth and then she's going to try and go back to sleep. y'all look at Simone Kevin's in here about to put Kaya back in the bed I guess he took her out to check on her or something and then he's going to read her to sleep girl don't you stand up making all that noise Devin is reading you to sleep let daddy read you to bed oh my gosh y'all Kaya was just angry like there you go, honey. Oh, y'all, look at Kaya. <laughs> so cute. How she all covered up by her pillows and stuffed animals. Adorable. Look at Devin just reading. Oh, she must be sleeping, y'all. He's stopping. Aw. And since Devin's already sitting in the chair after reading Kaya to sleep, He's going to go ahead and do his homework before he goes to bed. Devin is pulling an all-nighter, y'all. He ain't trying to get no sleep. So, he's having a really bad time. Sims who are exposed to things they dislike for extended periods of time will slowly be driven mad. Try surrounding them with things they prefer instead. But it also says that he's having a good time. Okay, Devin is confused. He don't know if he's having a bad time or a good time. Sims who are exposed to things they like for extended periods of time will slowly be driven to powerful good emotions. Okay. A happy moment. That must have been when he read Kaya to sleep with people. He loves being around people. Having a bad time. Sims who are exposed. Okay. So he just really have <laughs> y'all, he really having a bad time. Feels like Monday from disliking homework. That's really frustrating. Mainly because I don't stop doing it. Fun will decrease while this moolet is active. Whoa. Loved from tucking in a toddler. Caring for a toddler is his own reward. And he has a mild breakout. So Devin is really not feeling his homework right now. But he knows he has to do it because he's trying to put his family in a better financial spot. You know, so he's doing what he got to do because he is that man. Or whatever and Simone is just so ridiculous that she does not even appreciate him I don't know maybe she does appreciate him but she just she's trying to have her cake and eat it too I don't know y'all but Simone just she gotta come on with it but yeah y'all I am going to go ahead and stop the video right here if you enjoyed please give it a huge thumbs up comment any suggestions you may have down below if you have not already, please feel free to subscribe. I would love, love, love to have you here. And I will talk to you guys in the next video. Bye, y'all.